Hello everyone, we are back here and I have finished setting up my Facebook so you'll be able to check out that link in the description to send me a friend request which will allow you to simulate hacking my network and I believe uh, one person has already, yeah yes, Shadow RZ. If you're not already aware you're able to connect your Facebook account to your hackers account and then you can send me a friend request and once I accept it you'll be able to freely hack my network and give it a test shot and one thing I thought was kind of interesting that I honestly don't really like since it's just kind of like a test of someone else's network I don't think that they should have the any nodes upgrading but I guess that's just the way they did it it's a bit unfortunate I was hoping it wouldn't be that way so then you could get it an accurate hack on someone else's network since my since two of my AI are upgrading this person won't be able to get an accurate feel of how the network plays out which is a bit unfortunate but nevertheless my hawk is finished upgrading now so if you'd like to click that link in the description, send me a friend request, I'll check it every once in a while, and you can get set up with that. My blaster has finished upgrading to level 14, so now we'll be able to hack even higher level networks with those super high level guardians, or even just higher, higher level beetles which mine is going to level 7 now. I'm mainly focusing on my hawk since I'm only 6 levels away now from getting it to level 21. It's going to start doing a whole lot more damage in these next couple levels here. It's right now it's doing 220 per second which is a ton. Let's go see what we can find though. So here's a really good network to start off with. We're looking for money. That's going to be our focus. We're not too concerned about B coins since our stuff is finished upgrading um, and I'm just working on my currently working on the battering ram getting the battering ram upgraded so that way I may not even need to carry the wraith anymore I can just use battering rams to break through these lower level code gates that is the plan anyway and you're about to see how my Oh, you didn't give me that? Okay, let's see. Blasters. We're gonna get the blasters going here. And those are about the same level guardians as what I have. There's only three. And it's still cleaning through that core, just slicing it up. Boom, just like that. Every level I get uh, more on it, um, it'll be even better. Wow, I still lost that, that's insane. So we're just gonna head right over here. Okay. And try and get straight to his resources. Taking it easy. There we go. And I think we'll be able to actually 100% this network. Just that, that uh, code gate there with the. the antivirus because there's two AI right there are upgrading so I'm not even concerned about those and that should be everything that we needed just waiting on that boom plus three so that was uh, that person was at a lower reputation but we have five million now so we could start upgrading our low lo lower level guardian and I would also like to upgrade these code gates here get them started I need to get them up to level 14 like the others that's what I want anyways and then I think that'll pretty much use all of our building threads because yeah we only have one more there 
So we'll quickly upgrade that one and we'll be good. I am seeing more and more people than ever with over a million dollars in loot, which is very nice. I can get used to that. So we're just going to start off by cleaning up these code gates at the start. Using our shurikens here, it'll be quite easy to get through this network. That is uh, what I'm hoping anyways. Honestly, it's going really well. Just kind of going along the back of his network here to take out all these smaller nodes um, in a 1v1 against my beam cannons, so they can't really do anything against that. And just using my shurikens everywhere else is cleaning up here. Wow, I actually lost that sentry? Hmm. Oh, there we go. So it just kind of worked out that way. Going along the backside here to get all his loot. Didn't really need to do much more than that. I believe all we needed was two and a half million. Ah, yes. There we go. Getting those code gates upgraded again and up to speed with the other ones. That will be all I can do for this episode since all my building threads are busy upgrading. So let's take a look at my security log. Maybe we can check out some replays here. Um, a lot of interesting stuff. It's quite interesting to see who is failing. Sometimes people hack me twice and... You know, they, do, they, they get it on the first try, but don't get it on the second try. I don't know, maybe it's just I have stuff upgrading or something like that. But all in all, my network is holding up really well. You'll see all these people were, weren't able to get through anything. See here, Cow 3 capped my network. But then up at the top, he was unable to. Let's, so let's watch what happened here. So he already knows my network. He obviously made it through before and three capped me, but this time he wasn't able to, so maybe some small little mistake. Well, my hawk was finished upgrading there, so it's at level 15, doing that 220 damage per second, plus my sentry, obviously, at level 21. So that's good to keep in mind, all that damage per second. The antivirus is really spreads really quickly to the end part of the network oh did he stop it with his shocker there oh did he get it oh what oh i see it just barely made it through well played so what he did is he used his shocker to stop the antivirus from spreading which is a good play and with his portal coming through he has some wicked high level stealth programs so he definitely earned having that extra couple of steps with his portal there and I'm not quite sure what he's getting stalled on I mean he did have shurikens on there I don't know if he took them off double ice wall he's going with ice walls instead of a protector there on that choke and you'll see that even at level 15 ice walls, they're just getting shredded. So he really needs that protector, but it's only level 14. I think mine's only level 14 as well. And it's just getting blasted by the antivirus and that hawk there that he loses one of his battery rams, so he has one more there. I suppose he doesn't really need it. He made it through that code gate. Um, I don't know if he just didn't see that. I don't. I'm, I don't know. 
Did he not see that his protector was going down there? So unfortunately, I cannot go back and watch his other hack, but uh, that was quite interesting. Make sure to check out the description for that Facebook link so you can send me a friend request and try out my network yourselves without having to spend a bunch of time looking for me on the world map. I hope you guys all enjoyed, and I will see you all next time.